What is good, everybody? Welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today, we are back with another WWE action figure, I guess AEW action figure toy hunt as well. But it's been a while since I've just went on a toy hunt in my area, you know, hit a few stores around my area right here. So I'm thinking that's what we're going to do today, man. I'm about to get up, go to the car, get in it, drive to the stores, go inside, look at the aisles, film it, come back, show you guys do the thing, put it in the computer, edit it, put it on the internet, and do all the cool things, man. Now, we're obviously always on the lookout for AEW Chase figures. I'm still looking for a few of the Spider-Man retro card, like, men on card set. Uh, I kind of feel bad. I know I can get them on, like, Amazon and stuff like that, but I've seen them so many times, and I always turn them down, but I really just needed to bite the bullet and get them, but I never did. Now, here I am, so I probably need to find some of those, but you never know. You know, uh, I, I know that a lot of stuff is hitting retail. You never know if you're gonna stumble upon an Ultimate Edition Batista or something like that, so I'm I'm just gonna go to the stores and see what they have and maybe they'll have something awesome but anyways man join me on my ride let's go to these stores and i'll see you guys back here after we re return with whether we get stuff or not all right man first store of the day is walmart over here worst walmart in town man don't like this walmart in particular but well, we're gonna go in here and find out what they have also i'm gonna predict that the aisles are totally wrecked because the aisles are always wrecked here i'm always constantly having to fix up the aisles and and try to straighten them up we'll probably have to do the same here today man but hopefully they'll have something but yeah it's always destroyed it always makes me sick and i turn into a walmart employee and have to fix it but uh let's go ahead and see what they got all right, guys, here we are on the aisle. The other day, I actually put a couple stings up here. Okay, so there's still one. There's still one. It looks like somebody tried to hide it. I didn't hide it. I just put them up on the shelf, so that's that's one thing, but somebody got one of them. I just put it there. I don't know. I was just kind of messing around, but here's Sting. But that's pretty cool. It's still where I left it, I guess. I'm, I don't know if I'm going to grab it. I don't know. I may regret it later, but who knows. So in the section here, we got some AEW. We got Santana and Ortiz, it looks like. Decent condition here. Don't need them, but that's kind of cool, you know. We got a little Stu Grayson action. I've been seeing unmatched series. Oh, my God in heaven. Brody Lee completely shredded. Look at it, bro. Just look at it. Completely shredded. Hate to see it. Always with the bullsh. Anna J. I've been seeing Dark Order everywhere, man. Everywhere around the country has been hitting 17 crosses. Try to tell you guys. 17 million Bray Wyatt's. Try to tell you guys again. Elite 85 just warming up. Got some Beckys. Got a uh, hundred Jeffs. Why is this Jeff such a shelf warmer? Such a shelf warmer. It's horrific. Got a bunch of lives. Bunch of Jeffs. Still with the Jeffs, man. Jesus. Lots of battle packs here. I've been seeing this Brett and Undertaker battle pack everywhere. I just don't care for it. You know, I don't need it. I don't see any superstars figures. That's mainly what I'm looking for. We got battle packs, championship showdown packs. You know, the works. Oh. Oh, God. Jeff Hardy, top picks. Summer, SummerSlam, bro. We're almost at the next year's SummerSlam. Street Profits. ATV. Off-Road Fury 3. Well, what have we got up here? Oh, we got a little Brody Lee. Trying to hide a Brody Lee. I bet it's the same person trying to hide the sting. I guess they're just trying to, you know, store away some food for the wintertime. Brody Lee going on the shelf with the just destroyed Brody Lee. It's kind of weird because the Brody Lee's destroyed. I guess maybe they were going after the card packs and then they just stopped halfway through. I don't know what's going on there. Looks so weird though. A couple of Ortiz, got Cody. You know, I gotta fill up the shelves. I'm a I'm a part-time employee here at Walmart. I come in. It's actually way better than it usually is, but you know I'm a part-time employee. I come in, I clean up the aisle. Can't do nothing with that Brody. But I mean I probably could get it at a discount, but I'm not I'm not even gonna risk it, man. Yeah, same old, same old, bro. Busted up Brody. Hate to see it. Doesn't deserve that. Let's hit the next one. All right, guys, store number two. We got Target. Uh, Target's been slapping in 2022. We'll see if it carries over. See if we can keep the street going. We'll have to find out, but uh, I don't know what really to find, but I wanted a toy hunt anyway, so we'll see. All right, man, here at Target. Let's see what we got right here. Looking for, oh my God, it hit Royal Rumble Elite, bro. What the hell? This is the last thing I expected this morning. Got two earthquakes. Do not see Big E or Dakota Kai, but oh my god, bro. I did not expect this. I was not expecting this at the slightest. This is not what I expected this morning. That's insane. Anna J, Anna J, Silver, J, The Rock, Jeff Hardy. Dude, that's wild. I did not expect to see the Royal Rumble figures, man. That's insane. I don't see much else, but guys like the 
yelling over there, bro. That's insane, bro. Earthquake and Yokozuna. What up, dude? Unbelievable. Dude, look at Definitely grabbing these. Yeah, yeah, kind of. Um, so here, look, look, look at what I'm looking at, okay? Okay, because they have a whole box of Topps Heritage. Okay, and then we got Don Russ Basketball. All right, man, Walmart number two. This one is much closer to the house, so hopefully it'll be a lot damn better, bro, but let's go ahead and see what we got. All right, guys, let's see what we got. Looks like we got Series 7, another Sting. I see this everywhere now. Like, what the hell is that? Got the Young Bucks, Nick. We got FTR in the house. No Chase figures, Lance, Nyla, Nyla. The restock in Series 7. Restock in Series 7. Got an Anna J back there. So check your Walmarts for restock in Series 7. This is how people find Chase figures. This is how you find a Chase. Got another Sting. But check your Walmarts, man. I'm telling you. They're, they're restocking everywhere. If they're restocking here, they're restocking everywhere. Go check. I, I was right about Darby Allen. Got Jeff Hardy in the house. Jeff Hardy party all day. That rhymed intentionally. Tons of Charlotte basics. These have not moved in months. Got Bianca, Goldberg and Roman, Nia back there. These battle packs and Charlotte basics have not moved. Christ. Drew, Shelf Woman. Dude, just mark them to three to five bucks and get it over with. I still don't see superstars. Still don't see superstars. Lance Archer. Got Matt back here. Thought about grabbing this. I don't know. I'd like to have another one for, for just shishes and gigs. Nyla, I'm telling you, bro, go check your freaking, go check your Walmart. Here, somebody out there that's watching this right now is going to find a Chase Lance or a Chase Nyla. I'm telling you right now. Go find it. Somebody out there. Put Sting right here, but, I mean, this is a miss. Definitely a miss. I don't really need nothing. I, I thought about getting Stings and putting them on ice, but I just can't pull myself to it. Anyways, no superstars, no legends, no nothing, nothing I need. I guess I will see you guys back at the crib. Nice little Sonic figs. I'm getting out of here. All right, man, we are back home after the toy hunt now, and I'm pretty shocked at what we discovered, man. We got some good stuff. I am going to reveal it to you what we ended up picking up. But uh, what was up with that dude at Target, bro? That dude at Target was going crazy about the cards. I don't know what was going on right there. I don't know if he was a, a card flipper or something like that. It's kind of weird because at Walmart and Target, I was uh, I found boxes upon boxes of po Pokemon cards. It's this close to pulling the trigger, decided against it. But anyways, let's get into it. I just, I, I don't know. I, I, I want to do it some days, and then some days I'm like, nah, bro, don't need to dive into that. Let's find out what we picked up. First of all, man, we did finally stumble upon the Royal Rumble Wave. Now, this is something I never thought I would see in person. I thought that this figure line was long gone. Now, one thing that I'm clinging to is the next time I go to my Target, may go back tomorrow. One thing I'm clinging to is since I bought two of these figures, maybe they'll put Big E and Dakota Kai out on the pegs. I don't think somebody else bought them, but you never know. But we do have Earthquake right here, and I'm excited to have this. You know, we do have the suited body now. I need, who, who comes with the arms? Dakota Kai? So Somebody comes with the arms and we got to get a couple of, uh, they had two earthquakes. Why didn't I buy two earthquakes? Then I could have had an extra jacket. What an idiot. If I go back tomorrow and they have the rest of the wave, I'm probably going to buy the earthquake anyway because I'd like to have another jacket to put on my figure on commentary or something. You know what I'm saying? But this is cool. Very excited to find this in the wild there. Never thought I'd say it. Like this line has been very suspect. Been popping up some places, not popping up in others. So that's been kind of worrying me. But here we go. Pretty cool packaging on this guy. So we did grab earthquake and then we also grabbed Yokozuna. So we did grab Yokozuna as well. Two big gentlemen right here. It's kind of weird. You have Yokozuna, you have Earthquake, and you have Big E, and then you have Tiny Dakota Kai. So that's kind of cool. But yeah, we have Yokozuna here. Haven't had a Yokozuna in forever. I can't really... I've, the last Yokozuna I bought at that Target was years ago, and it was the Hall of Fame Yokozuna. And uh, here I am, picking up another one. That's pretty cool. Doesn't have double jointed arms, but it is cool to get another Yokozuna with some cool things. He does come with the head sculpt and megaphone, I think. 
think of Jimmy Hart. So that's pretty cool right there. But we did grab Yokozuna and we grabbed Earthquake. Other things that we found, now I did buy these. Hold up. I went ahead and bought a box of these um, because I had to scratch the, the card itch, I guess. But it's the Women's Division trading cards. I opened all of them up. Kind of lackluster, to be honest with you. I got, uh, I think, one Relic card. It was a Bianca Belair. But it didn't really make sense because... Um, so the one I got is the 1 of 99 Bianca Belair Relic Fast Lane 2021 Authentic Matte Relic, which I get... I don't know if this is a part of the matte from the whole event or if this is just the matte from her match. It doesn't really... I, like, did they not all use the same matte? It's just kind of random that it's Bianca Belair, you know what I mean? I don't, I don't know how that works, but uh, it's a pretty cool piece. 1 of 99. It's the 74 out of 99, but it is a 1 of 99 piece, which is cool. But... I don't really, uh, this is a really, like, I got a few hollows, but this is really the only cool card, really, in the whole set. I felt like it was kind of a boring set. A couple hollows, but they were, like, not, like, main hollows. They were hollows of, like, moments, and it was very weird. Not very interesting, to say the least. But this was a cool pull, I guess. I don't know what this goes for. I guess we can kind of see, but, uh, I don't know. I may hang on to that. I may, if anybody's interested in that, I'm open to a trade or something. But I just kind of felt like opening one of these boxes. It says, find one autograph relic or autograph relic. Look for autographs, patch cards, map relic and more may contain redemption cards with expiration dates. It was cool for what it was. Don't know if I'll do it again. Um, I was glad that it's Bianca Belair because I know she has some demand, but at the same time, it's like, I don't know, man. Nonetheless, that's all I grabbed. There wasn't a whole lot. How about that Brody Lee that was literally like, ripped open? You had a couple stings there. You, we did find the Royal Rumble Elites, which was really awesome. Did not expect that, but... That pretty much wraps up our toy hunt, man. Not a ton of stuff going on with it, but, you know, I did find two of the set. Maybe we can find Biggie and Dakota Kai later, and we can build Jimmy Hart, put MDT in a pink jacket, and all will be right in the world. Another thing that I just thought about is the Build-A-Figure now, like the, the new Build-A-Figures. We've had these Build-A-Figures for years, man. They need to update that. We need a slim suit body for guys like Finn Balor and stuff, and we also need double-jointed suited arms. Anyways, guys, that is going to wrap up today's toy hunt. Thank you guys so very much for watching. Let me know what you would have grabbed down in the comment section below. If anybody's out there is an expert on this Bianca Bella relic card or anything about this wave or do you guys find these interesting let me know down below i've seen some pretty cool pulls out of it but i wasn't that impressed outside of a couple picks here and there so you guys can let me know but anyways thank you for watching subscribe to the channel follow me on instagram twitter and tiktok at my name toys i'll see you guys in the next one and go out there and happy hunting for whatever the hell you're looking for you cross the line i've been